I'll take you around the facility, check out all the cars, all the Mopars. Definitely more than you can probably even get to in a day. I don't even think we can look at all these cars. There's just too many going on. Every color, every shape, every model, every Mopar you can think of. We got it. Got some old Ram truck. Roadrunner. Charger RT. Got the newer stuff over here. Got some Hellcats. Got a T. Ooh. We're going to stop and look at this guy. We got a legit little red express right here. Great looking truck. It's clean. Definitely don't see these things anymore, that's for sure. Got the stacks on it. Clean little red express. All right, let's jump back into golf cart and find some more cool mo cars. I hear the autocross going on. We're going to go down there and check that out as well. Ooh, hang on. Duster. I love me a duster and this one looks really nice. Got a bunch of information going on here with it. 364 barrel. Oh wow, he's got the original price ticket. Four grand almost to buy you a duster back in the day. Man, I wish they were that much now. Great looking car. There's a sweet, sweet duster. Let's catch it from this side. Heck yeah. Definitely a thumbs up in my book right here on Mopars. I love the dusters. All right, we have a great of five gallons of BC. seen this thing on uh, Instagram I mean I don't hate it I think it looks kind of cool a charger El Camino basically I mean it looks good it looks like it was made that way that is awesome he's got a book here with how they did everything I mean, that is absolutely awesome Badass build right there. Thumbs up. Something different. Something you don't see every day right there. Charger Super B El Camino job. Hell yeah. Get some. What else we got? Uh, I don't know what's going on with this thing over here. Looks like we got a little kid in timeout. I mean, <laughs> that'll work. Got a project going on for sale. Ooh, all right. 
definitely got to look at this. It's hard to find a good looking Cuda, and they cost a tremendous amount today. Nice green Cuda. Nice, nice car. Super clean. Yep. Always love the hoods on those cars. Definitely, definitely a thumbs up. Go up here and see if we can find out. Alright, I think I see a road runner over here. Super bird, super bird. Get a quick look at this guy real quick. Oh yes. Got Wiley driving. What's up, Coyote? Never catching that bird. That bird is uncatchable. Can't do it. No one's ever caught the old super bird. I like it. Definitely a thumbs up. Well, I'm going to show you this one too. That's some cool graphics. Rat pink under the hood there. This new ch ch uh, new Challenger. 426. Looks like we got a Whipple on top of it or something. Yeah. Man, I'm trying to zoom through these cars as fast as possible for you guys. Oh my God, hold up. Charger RT, got the right color, 69, mm. that's where it's at right there, that's all you got to know. That is definitely the Mo Power of all Mo Powers. This car is nice. Super nice. Guy came all the way from Alabama, pretty much about close to me. Yes, sir. Thumbs up if you see the video. Bad ass ride. Good job. Find out what we can see down here. Looks like we got an SRT 10 Ram. We'll give it a quick peek. Quick peek. All blacked out. Nice and clean. Looks nice. We know what's going on there. Got a biker engine. Nice truck. Whoever it is, thumbs up. Another duster. You guys know I'm a sucker for the duster. That's a good, nice looking black one right there. We'll run across here real quick. See what we can find in the old show and shine lot. Got a shaker, challenger, convertible. Man, I'm telling you what, that's, that's a shaker right there. Great big old hole in the wind in the, in the hood. Beautiful car. Got the three forty six pack. Awesome car, definitely a thumbs up. A couple more. 
awesome looking trucks. Here's old Dodge 100. Looks like we're bagged. Battleship gray maybe on the paint. Nice truck. With a new Hemi swap. Got a new Hemi swap motor going in on it. Definitely a nice truck. Thumbs up for you, sir. We're kind of off-roading here, guys, so sorry for the jiggly camera. Looks like we got a drag. Drag Cuda here. Let's check this guy out. It's got a little bit of motor. Nice and shiny and clean, that's for sure. Nice one. Thumbs up to you, sir. Nice looking car. Nice hot rod. Got another 100 over there. Right, let's go down here and watch these guys tear up these Hellcats. We may try to take a ride in one. I don't know. We'll see if we can get some time. Of course, we got the General Lee car over here. Going to be doing a General Lee jump. Zoom in here, check it out. All right, they're about to send some more. Gap this golf cart. You gotta gap him. Oh, all right, we're gonna gap him right here. Here we go. Here we go. 1951. That's definitely old. I ain't never even seen one of them. Great uncle. Suburban? Been nice out here. Yeah, 32 Plymouth 1951 Plymouth Suburban. I've never seen one. Hell, I ain't never even heard of one, heard of one honestly. <laughs> that is a beautiful looking car. 
I could definitely cruise the streets on that one. A big bad cruiser right there. I've seen that thing there somewhere. All right, we're getting down here closer to the drag strip area. Got old Dakota, drag truck. Got a Viper over there. Handful of Challengers. And I see a newer Ram that's been done up like a little red express back there. So we're gonna go check it out real quick. Let's go walk over here and check it out. There you go, Scott Long. Little red express, new age Ram. He's even got the twice pipes on. Got twice pipes, baby. Nice looking truck. I like it. Got the little Red Express floor mats going on in here. Nice looking truck. Thumbs up. Good job, man. down here and see what else we can find. Tons and tons of stuff going on. I'm telling you guys, you gotta come down here. If you're a Mopar lover, you're gonna find everything you can think of. And I mean everything. And then probably some things you don't think of. Old Chrysler car right there, old Ford Banger. All the vendors down here. Got the Renegade fuel truck. Got the drag pits over here. Frostbite's chilling out over here in the torque storm booth. I'm gonna show you their setup real quick now that we're running the better camera. They have an awesome CUDA, by the way, guys. That's running one of their Ford Storm setups. This is their car that they use for the autocross events. Definitely a cool car. It's running the Blackout Edition Torque Storm. Definitely a sweet car. This is the Torque Storm Boost, where they have all the different supercharger applications to show you how they run on the front of the motor. I mean, they show everything. Everything. Here's the twin kit for the Mopar that has finally come out. This is the black edition. You get two superchargers. Count them, two superchargers. Lots of people checking out the merch. We got Frostbite hanging out. We've, met, we've ran some bad ass passes today, guys. Thumbs up the Frostbite. The truck is holding together, holding good. So glad we got it fixed and made it up here. Not to mention, run 11s. That's what I'm talking about. That's their up, the other Tour Storm truck. It's older Ram, third gen, running a 6.1 motor with one of their units. Definitely a cool truck. Awesome, awesome. 
Right here next door, we got, looks like Mopar Connection. We got a Cuda, 70, Hemi Convertible. With the crazy purple. Yes, sir, and yes, ma'am. It's a beautiful looking car. Definitely a beautiful car. Worth a ton of money, that's for sure. Worth a ton of money. Very, very, very nice. Very nice. I've seen just as many men as I've seen straight. But like I said, definitely some nice cars sitting over here. drag racing area i think we got some cars running the eighth mile so i'm gonna show you guys a little bit of footage on some drag runs got some badass awesome mopars running on the eighth mile course right now so let's go check them out
so took you around mo party a little bit over here in kentucky hope you guys enjoyed it i know i'm having a blast there's absolutely just massive massive mopar everywhere mopar community just everybody's out here it's absolutely awesome guys definitely if you have the time come check out mo party it's so worth it i will definitely be at the very next one that they have that's at least within driving range this was a blast you've got to go so anyway guys hope you enjoyed the video we're gonna go get frostbite ready to make some more runs to get ready for tomorrow for the eliminations so as always stay safe out there don't forget hit that subscribe button we'll see you on the next one peace